Greetings, beloved of my father. We always like to welcome you to this most exciting cooking show on this planet and under the banner of Ndawayam. And of course, the program is Kitchen Pulpit, where we preach not with Bibles, hymn books, study guides, but we do it with pork, pans, and ingredients. And we are so excited to let you know that there is no other place you can be on this day than to be on Kitchen Pulpit. Wow, we're going to see how you're doing today. Fine, how are you, Uncle? I'm doing fine. I always see a lot of uh, things happening here, but today it looks like we're just going to have a surprise. Is it a surprise? Yes. Wow, <laughs> I can't wait for the surprise. But all I know is she is going to make pizza for us. But I'm just thinking, wow, will this pizza be edible with all this? But since it's a surprise. So, wow, if you're ready for the surprise, just sit back, relax, and enjoy. There was the surprise. We are preparing plant based pizza. Plant based pizza in Chesha and is an eggplant and in Chesha and is a mushroom to get the dough in and to get the sauce in a, in a system seed sauce. So the first thing that you are going to prepare is the mushroom. Mushroom you chop it, you wash it, you chop it, you squeeze out all the water. Branda Ipele I want then you add the salt. So we are going to prepare it now. You add a little bit of oil, about a tablespoon of cooking oil. You know it's gonna need two cups the chopped mushroom. So we add the mushroom. And we fry it, push kayanya to we are tender and crispy. For flavor, we are going to use spring onion. Spring onion and chop up finely, we are to add the ram. Put your twilight patrubu bigger, the flavor of the spring onion. If you need the mushroom, it will have flavor in the ram. Mushroom is done, well cooked, crispy, and mm, looking nice. Then we remove it from the stove. And we continue with our eggplant. Uh, for our pizza, we are going to use two and a half cups brown flour. Um, Cup bran and one teaspoon yeast, then a teaspoon of salt. I will repeat half cup bran, one teaspoon yeast, one teaspoon salt, two and a half cups brown flour, and two tablespoons cooking oil. We add two tablespoons cooking oil. Then we are going to knead it to make a nasty dough. We 
when this is done, I'm going to add um, the rest of the vegetables. Voila! Well, I almost forgot the word I wanted to say. Surprise. The surprise is here yeah. and it's looking scrumptious and I just forgot what I wanted to say. <laughs> now I just want to test, can I go ahead and do so? Do so. Alright. Yeah. But before you eat uh, cooked food, sometimes you must then prepare the mm -hmm. uh, let me start me the cucumber. Well, we don't want the therapy there. No, let me take it into the pizza. This is the pizza. I wish it allow us to test everything that is. Oh. Well, um, we just have to come and join us from the kitchen puppets to then know how we all test. Like I said, and I always say this, if you really want to make this in the comfort of your home, do not hesitate, follow the link on your screen or call us at the Grain Up or just visit our website for you to get not only about how to make this awesome pizza, but all the other ingredients and recipes for food that will give you good health. And don't forget our pair of life. For me, we turn world health, world, your party world. Ah, uh, let's not say it's a most Wow, see you on the next program. Me and the pizza, we are God. <laughs>